Greetings friends and happy November. So as most of you know, November is our last project of the year, other than we do do some Christmas ornaments, so stay tuned for those in December. So because it's our last project of the year and because there's so many holidays coming up, we've decided to do a bit of a choose your own adventure kind of project. You can see here, out of the same project kit, I've made two different things. I made a snowman here on my left and I made a turkey here on my right. And so I'm gonna set these aside. I'm gonna show you the pieces you're gonna use and how I put these together. And I'm actually gonna demonstrate the turkey because it uses all the pieces, but you can do whatever you want. So in your bag, you're gonna get two little, two round pieces of wood. Um, this one is not quite round, it's kind of funny. So it's a good one for me to use as an example. This one is round. Uh, you're also going to get a tiny little popsicle stick, five of these tiny little clothespins. What I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna figure out kinda how I want this to be. If yours doesn't wanna stand at all, what you can do is you can grab a piece of sandpaper. This is 80 grit sandpaper and you can figure out how you want it oriented. And then you can just sand a flat spot on it. But that helps keep it from wobbling. Um, then the other thing to do is just figure out how I want this piece to go. So I'm gonna lay them down like this. Uh, front facing down and I'm going to use hot glue because it allows me to go fast here for demonstration purposes but you can use wood glue, super glue, you can use all kinds of things. So I'm going to put a little bit of glue on here where I'm going to put my trusty popsicle stick. Put my popsicle stick on there and that'll, that'll dry pretty quick since I used hot glue. Get that situated. Okay, so I got that on there. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put these little clothespins on there. And the reason I'm going to put the clothespins on there is because that's what's going to hold my feathers. So while those dry, we're going to cut feathers. And I've already got some cut, so I'm going to set those here. But I'll show you all I did was I took three different colors of construction paper and I took a pencil and, and made a mark. And then I just took my X-Acto knife but you can use scissors. Um, if you have other stuff laying around, for instance, when we did the dream catchers, we used feathers. Uh, those probably just glue those straight to the back. There's all kinds of things you can do. So let's take, let's put a yellow one up behind his head. We got something that kind of resembles a turkey. So the next thing I'm gonna do is paint it. Now I have my finished turkey. Thanks for joining us, and if you come up with, well, I'd like to see your turkeys and snowmen too, but I'd like to see whatever you come up with. So share some pictures with us, and I uh, hope you all have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And